Hello Aries, this is your reading for the 5th through the 7th. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome. Please like, share, subscribe, comment. Thank you guys for coming. Happy birthday to those of you whose birthday falls between the 5th and the 7th and all month long. Happy birthday to me as well. <laughs> Thank you guys for coming. Let's see, what messages do we have for Aries in love? Aries in love, what messages do we have for Aries? The Six of Wands, look at that. You know, you guys are always showing up and showing out. You hear me? Okay. You guys are, I feel, wanted. <laughs> Um, I feel like, you know, a lot of people are attracted to you guys. A lot of people look up to you guys here. Okay. But you have energy there. I feel like you're very confident during this period. Okay. You speak your mind, most definitely. I do get that there is probably an air sign individual that is wanting your attention. Um, and you're not giving it though. Okay. I feel like this person can be a little overbearing at times. I feel like this person is also loyal though. Okay. So this is a thing. Um, and, and what I'm getting here is that the reason why loyal comes out is because for some reason you guys feel like this individual was unfaithful. You feel like they had several people, if not several people, um, at least one other person, or that they they liked attention from other people. Here, I get that this person is more um, emotionally unavailable than anything else. Okay, let's see what else do we have for Aries. The Nine of Wands. Mm. Somebody's on guard here. I feel like this is, you know, I'm feeling like this is an energy that is shared between the two of you. It's like neither one of you wants any trouble. Neither one of you wants any conflict. Um, both of you want to be successful. Both of you want to be happy. You want to do things that make you happy. And I'm also getting that both of you are quite possibly waiting on each other to approach in this situation here. That Sagittarius energy. The High Priestess. Because neither one of you is speaking. It's a lot you guys don't know about each other. The different movements that each other is making currently. Okay. I'm getting that you guys probably share a lot of energy between the two of you including like you know you guys share certain behaviors too you probably just don't realize it and they don't either okay I'm feeling like you guys are really connected here okay please show me more about the six of wands energy the emperor I'm feeling you very strongly okay you guys know what you know, and that's just the end of it. You're not budging. Um, you're not... If they're expecting you to come towards them, I don't see that. Okay, you're confident in who you are. Please show me more about this King of Swords energy here. The Five of Pentacles. This is definitely somebody I feel like that's not really in touch with their... Um, their spiritual side, spiritual growth here. Um, I feel like this person holds grudges. This person feels very hurt and uh, rejected by you guys. This could be Taurus, Gemini energy here. I'm feeling like you guys weren't growing either that there was a sense that, you know, you guys were not going to be together for the long haul. 
this person, you may have put this person out, they may have put you out of a home, um, but I'm, I'm getting that both of you were hurt in this situation for one reason or another, um, whether physically, whether one of you was physically put out or whether one of you was just like felt really rejected, but both of you felt hurt, okay, in this situation. Please show me more about the Nine of Wands energy here. The Tower. I feel like both of you, again, if you look at this card, there's not, there's not one, even two people in this card. There's like, there's one person falling out right here, and then there's two people down here, and then there's this dude um, with some sort of stick or spear. So I feel like both of you have been through some shit okay I feel like both of you have awakened to certain things in this connection but one of you I feel has just gone through something one of you has just gone through something here recently somebody has been knocked off their high horse in this situation somebody's been knocked off their high horse let's see let's pull another card for tower please show me more about this tower energy for Aries Please show me more about this tower energy for Aries. Scorpio Sag energy there. Please show me more about this tower energy for Aries. Eight of Wands. Somebody's been put out. Or either, you know, this person is really... If this person was put out of your home... And this has not happened recently. This person still feels some kind of way. Still very defensive. Still very angry that they had to move. This person's very angry. Again, I'm, I'm feeling like. Um, there is a lack of spiritual growth. I feel a lot of ego. I feel a lot of anger. I feel a lot of, of, of cold, overbearing, controlling energy here. This person has probably, you know, these feelings have probably come up too because if you guys, this is separating from this person this person had to leave your home then I'm feeling like they have just had they have just had to move again and so having to move again is like it dredges up all this other these other feelings with you guys over here hmm. please show me more about this high priestess energy Then we have the Eight of Pentacles. Somebody wants to rebuild this connection. You guys have been in a cycle with this individual as well. Um, there's something that I feel like they just want to get over. They want, want something to like be over with or get over with. Um, It's like you guys haven't communicated in a while and they want to just communicate to get it over with. So they can either, you know, either you guys can work things out and together and like rebuild this connection from this tower energy right here that 
where things were like shook to pieces or they can move on by themselves it's like there's something that they really want to know in regards to you guys here okay wanting to wrap up a cycle wanting to end something here maybe it's like the the beef <laughs> whatever between you guys here they shouldn't even look at this eight of pentacles energy the five of wands wanting to end the beef wanting to know whether or not you guys can actually be a couple again be happy together or and rebuild this connection or whether they need to you know remove themselves if it's still too much conflict here you know to to work on themselves and move on okay let's see what energy is coming towards you guys i'm getting long-winded with you guys here let's see what energy is coming towards aries what energy is coming towards aries what energy is coming towards aries judgment hmm. having to make a decision one way or the other you know taking a good hard long look at yourself look at them the situation and deciding you know where you guys go from here Let's see what this is the magician virgo scorpio energy here hmm somebody wants to um rebuild this relationship oh something flipped over there look at that there you are queen of wands somebody's trying to decide what to do with you i feel like this person has probably been trying to reach you guys some kind of way not verbally though because I'm, I'm getting very strongly here with the High Priestess energy. You guys aren't talking. Somebody has been trying to reach you some kind of way. But all I feel you guys can think about is the conflict that you guys shared. Like it was never ending. If you got along, it was only good for a short period. Is what I'm hearing for some of, some of you guys here. Let's see. Seven of Swords. This person. Hmm. This person did some shady stuff. This person did some shady stuff. They know they did some shady stuff, but they want to come back here. They want to fix this, whoever this is. Okay, Aquarius energy is here now. So Aquarius, Leo, Virgo, Scorpio. Sagittarius, Gemini, Taurus, Leo. Yep. So that's what I have for you guys. And um, I'll be speaking with you guys soon.